Alrighty, so good afternoon, everybody. So I think we left off. Yeah, we left off right here trying to find this place. And after so long, we just had to give in and find, you know, look it up online. I don't like doing that, but I couldn't take it. We spent like an hour, if not more, literally just trying to find this place. So take a look at the forest of grave markers. That's what happens to dragon slayers. They say there's an open space at the top of the mountain where they played the tune of monster calling only to incur the dragon's wrath. They say a raging serpent unleashes a furious assault for a while and then has to rest for some amount of time. But what difference would it make? Nobody has ever survived such an onslaught anyway. Yeah, I'll buy some more of them, why not? I know a nice town unreachable by foot or ship. It lies at those coordinates called Balak Rise. An interesting hideaway sporting a spyglass on the roof. I can get there by using uh, using a special item of mine, but it's totally out of reach for most people. With the dragon at your command, however, you can probably just zoom straight there. Hmm. Young Sprout, you want to take... You want take cursed dolls for me. They say bring a gory death to owner. Please, you take for me. Yes, yeah, sure. It's so creepy. Long time I searched for new art owner. Thank you, thank you. Kramer dolls. Kramer dolls. Press the square button to activate the dolls who play a melody that attract monsters. They stimulate imprisoned monsters and draw them out before the party. Anyone, everybody who owned them so far went die in Dragon's Lair on South Fire Mountain. Stay far from South Fire Mountain. No one, you get fried like chicken. Oh, that really hurt to say. Um, let's use Jet here. Ah, you think you're so sneaky trying to hide from me? Something over that way. Let me run. What is it? Is this one? Oh. Ooh, another revive fruit. Who are you? You're another outsider snooping around town, right? Another type? It's good to dream, kid, but never forget to keep your feet on the ground. Uh, so they're talking about dragons. South of the mountain. The blight of our land is unfortunate. You're not really giving me much information to go off of. So let's go in here. This is the last uh, place that we have to go. All right, you're kind of just standing there looking a little sus. And you're crying. All right, first off, who are you? The verse they have about the dragon here. It is... That it is still told verily, or still told verily, suggests that the beast still lives within the world of man. Indeed, it must be. And who shall posterity honor as slayer of the dragon? None other than I, Galahad. Yes. All right. G Howdy. I saw what you were doing. Howdy. If you're needing warm food and dry bed, yep. All right, I'll take it. All right, now we'll chat with her. We have a saying in these parts, it goes like this. What would you ask of a dragon? Dragons are not property. They listen to no one. But if you must ask, give the dragon something in return, and then your request may be granted. The dragon seeks to satisfy a single desire. It is that which she cannot have. No matter how strong in battle, no matter how swift in flight, it taunts her forever out of reach. It is to cease being a dragon. It is to lay her infernal wrath to eternal rest. It is to be free from her bonds to this war-torn world. I'm not so sure what they were trying to say, but so many have drifted through here, seeking to conquer the dragon. Tell me. You don't speak. At least I'll think. No. Huh. 
All right. I'm going to screen flash a little bit. I've, I have this Hyperkin. It's a AV to HDMI thing in it. Ever since I bought it, it's been acting up a little weird, so. Let me just mess around with it. Like I said, you'll see. You'll see it flicker a little bit. Oh, God. All right. Clearly wants to play games today. You gonna be good? Fingers crossed. I'll probably just have to buy another one down the road. All right, let's leave. So they're mentioning a something south. It's still acting up, I apologize. Things just being pain in the ass. Alright, so we're supposed to go south. Is there something around here that... see anything you mentioned south It's not a volcano. Uh, yeah, it's gonna it's gonna throw me in fights. Actually, gonna need to end up going back to Jolly Roger.
No! Oh well. We'll repair our, our sandcraft. I hit the wrong button. That's what I get though. Got gone you today in Genshin Impact, so that's always good. Uh, I had like one intertwined fate, and I was just like, you know what? People are saying she's pretty good. Might as well give it a shot. I hit the pull button, or you know, the wish button, and boom, got her, so. I think I leveled it up like 50 or something, just for the heck of it. I haven't been playing much of it, just kind of you know traversing here and there just doing the dailies and and trying to progress through whatever story missions and quests that the game give you know that that you're allowed in and stuff and um that's pretty much about it that repair ship Unfortunately. All right, let's try this again. Now our ship is repaired. At least it's not too far of a trek. I have a feeling this is where we gotta go because this sign should actually say like going this way there's a dragon's lair or something yeah he who seeks dragons may dive into the mall where's our where's our whistles we ride horses now wait there's no millennium that's a millennium puzzle isn't it What is up with all these random encounters? Stop. Wait, is it, maybe there's no... Nothing here? Is it on this side? I will complain about this every single stream. I hate the world map in Wild Arms. Wild Arms 2, it sucked. It doesn't, it's not any better in, in 3. That's my only complaint is, it's very annoying that you have to find the location. I don't want to fight these. For one, they're annoying. Let me escape. I'm way over level to even be here. Thank you. No point to fight, unfortunately. Oh, well, it's just a... Man, I had some momentum going into that one. 
All right, can we eat first try? Your luck sucks. All right, we'll, we'll kill him for the sake of hoping to get some dragon fossils. Take like three turns each to kill. Maybe not. dragon fossil i won't complain now i mean i probably still will but where's the fun in it you know dragon's lair let's save even though i feel like we're genuinely overpowered i just don't trust it That's too low. I, if the game volume's too low, please let me know. I've just found that it's been in like in like the vods, it's been relatively loud. I mean, I, I can always turn it up, you know, in the future, so that's no big deal. Let's see what enemies we're gonna fight. Electricity, huh? All right Must be some sort of counter-attack move well, he's most likely dead fossil all right I guess we'll see what's uh, on both sides It's always really nice when enemies are grouped together. Good 
Good job, Jet. Ever since we found that garden, it's just been the game got easier since we, you know, we have 93 heal berries, these, and like we haven't even gone back yet. I'm genuinely curious to see what this is. Necrosaurus. Something tells me that you are all weak to light. Hey yo. Wait, what? Where did I get turned around at? Hello? Interesting. no easy way to get rid of them or at least that I know of gonna power through it this is gonna take a long time can I like prevent him from ow dude One second chat. All right, let me look and see. Let me just test this to see if it even works. So something's there. Is 
Sorry about this chat. Okay. I want to try something. Like, if it's weak to thunder, what happened? Hey, we did it. Everybody's defending, which is good. Still gonna take a hell of a lot of damage. All right, well now, now this, now this is easy. Oh my gosh, yeah. Okay, I see you. All right, we're gonna give you two out of two. Oh, you failed. is in danger I mean I don't think so oh please okay do not no oh, all right that one that hurt a little not yet we're just gonna defend until party arrives I mean, we're, honestly, worst case scenario is that they kill Clive, we just use a gimbal coin and then all board party members are in the fight, so I'm honestly not worried. Yeah, there they are. Okay, all right, well, you are all together. And now you are dead. Yeah, dude, uh, Dallas actually just got it for me, uh, as a, uh, uh, like a late Christmas present. Oh, I know, I just slapped the mic a good one. Isn't it, isn't it sweet? Oh, hang on, I can't stand up. Uh, you can't really see it too, too well, but it's nice. It's comfy. It fits pretty nice, too. Yeah. Getting hot there, so I might have to take it off. <laughs> Jet, you're one for three. All right, where we go? Listen, all I know is as long as I don't go outside of that area, we'll be good. What is this? Of course. Is it a mimic? It is! Cannot wait for my chair to show up tomorrow, hopefully. Yeah, that mimic there was no way of escape. Oh, and two dragon fossils. Okay, okay. Yeah, a call whistle. Well, I don't know what just happened, but hey. Look it up. Well, this doesn't help. Yes. 
Ambushed again? I specifically have an item on a character that says you cannot be ambushed. <laughs> Yeah, just imagine all the am ambushes. Frustrating. I mean, yeah, it's free experience and money, but like... All right, back to what I wanted to do. Yeah, it didn't do anything. It was a waste. Jump back down. Well, now that I know that that's a thing, keep an eye out on it, I suppose. And I just gotta look for any strange. Nope, ain't even dealing with it. Like, I know what this game is trying to pull here. Anything hidden? No, of course. What? What? That's... that's dumb. There's nothing up here, is there? I guess I was just up here, duh. So, this dungeon's weird. I don't see any other strange crack. Besides from that, and that's about it. No, oh, now I'm gonna have to be in encounters. Yeah, this isn't an ambush. This is, this unfortunately is intentional. Bye bye. I want a critical hit. See ya. Another chest. Oh, you opened it. All right, concentrate. What happens if I fall? Aha! Look at that. Don't you think that's not obvious? All right, got to think. Get this treasury. I think I think we're figuring it out. We're solving the puzzle. What are you? Uh, okay. Um, easily enough that we now know that if we hit the Thunder Drake with a Thunder Attack, um, we're able to hit it physically then. 
He's dead, so that's good. This move hurts, but our party's not, you know, too worried about it. Nice dodge. Nice Sue. Die. Thank you. And then we just hit this thing with physical attacks. Come on, Gallows. We tried. So many treasure chests. All right, Jet, let's go. Nice. I probably should heal him. He looks like he's out of vitality. All right, now to put the bomb back. I, I know where we are in a sense, but there's some other things back there I want to That I want to get or uh, explore rather treasure chests coming from jet really I heal you and then you go and do this to me you have the best luck on the team like it literally says well maybe not here it uh, where it usually yeah luck at the very bottom right over there it says best and he still blows shit up all the time These drifters, I tell ya. Ten gallon hat. Ooh, duplicator. Okay. I see you. I don't want to fight anymore, so any action that prevents me from getting into an encounter, I'll gladly take. Any hidden blow up walls? Question mark? No? Okay. Alright, I could fall. Yep. That seems to be the best play. Please let that be what we're supposed to do. You know what? I'm gonna save right here. Just in case. Oh yeah. It's all coming together. Boom. As I was saying earlier, I was playing some Genshin Impact and uh, had had one summon, so I figured to do it, and I got Ganyu, the new five star. Ah, oh, we're trapped. It's over. GG. A rumbling howl shakes the mountain. It causes the roof of the tunnel to collapse, blocking the way back. I don't recall receiving an invitation, but it seems now we'll have to go meet our eager host. Our eager host. 
Oh, this doesn't look like a battlefield if I've ever seen one. Wait, do we just wait? We'll see what happens. This, if we don't kill him, it's gonna hurt. Uh, basic. I mean, might as well save our materials. It's not like it's not. You know, we're not gonna die to this thing. So, I'm okay with the dragon fossils, honestly. I think, I think honestly, I think we were only a few. Oh no, we got a way to go. Never mind. You know what now that i'm thinking about it so we got the we got this new tool for for gallows called the kramer dolls they're cursed if we use them they bring monsters to us so i'm you i'm wondering if we need to use that to bring the boss or something here we're gonna try it worst case scenario is we get into an enemy encounter we just wipe them so and it's free dragon fossils I honestly don't see any indication. Uh, you can't move five feet before getting an encounter here. Um, but I don't see any indication of like anything that would uh, give us like a way over that hill, so. Punch him in the back. Tell him, Clive. Jet, you know I trust you. And you just fail me every time. Alright, let's try these Kramer dolls. Seems to have done it. Hey, that's a Durgan. Could it be? Yo, it's a... That thing's pretty dope looking. Is it an ultimate weapon? Who dares trespass upon my lair? Is he who calls out my name one who seeks honor? So this is the dragon ultimate weapon of legend she's made contact with my mind if i don't watch it she'll crush my crush my soul like a grape mortals tiny mortals if my strength thou dost the desire then face my trial thou must you're on let's go bit boy so you're in the title of dragon slayer dost thou then have at thee. Show me thy metal and do not hold back. Seems easy enough. Everybody defend, analyze. Let's do this. Lombardia. What do you do? Cerebral matter. Evasion. Oh, oh my God. All right. Um. First things first, let's lucky card. Let's try to hit him and we will. Oh, wait, wait. No, no, no one can slow him down. I 
except for you. Let's try to decelerate him. Epidermal shell. Reduces attack damage, reduces magic damage. All right, Gallows, you're gonna be on the... That missed, didn't it? Oh wait, that was the Jella card. Uh-huh. Is he racer? I imagine that's the one. Yep, okay. Mighty might. Critical hit, let's go. some damage might as well get what we can in missile might this shouldn't hurt oh it's attacking gallows all right nice all right virginia go on the offensive only because she needs to get her force points back up to a reasonable level just in case uh this thing like aoe cleaves me We don't need to worry. We'll just keep it up. Flashing red, uh oh. Kind of curious to see what happens if, like, we were used the refrigerate skill. Does it, like, actually cool them down or something? Okay, so it's kind of similar. It was either a fight in one arms one or two. Or like he's I guess you can consider him overheated Dude, yeah, just beat the hell out of him. Let's go. Oh Oh my god Such might from warriors so small valiant mortals. I ask thee what th dost thou seek in butchering me? It is not to be known as a dragon slayer is it not to be known as a dragon slayer as so many have tried before thee? Then the power of infernal dragon's breath thou seekest? Not honor, not power. Mortals, I know not what thou did couldest desire from me. Say what it is and be done with it. I want something that can only be had if your desires are met. Hmm. An odd request. Mortals, dost thou truly claim to know my inclinations? Well, you see, I think that my goals and your goals are one and the same. Then answer this. Mortals who would know of a dragon's wishes, can thou give me what I seek?
What will thou give me? Thou dare underestimate the power of a dragon? Thy time of reckoning is a hand. Oh, wait, are we dead? Oh shit, he just straight up kills us. That's kind of cool though. I'm not mad about it. I kind of saw that coming. All right, well, he's a bitch, so. He ain't gonna live very long. Uh, let's do refrigerate. And then she'll just completely keep, you know, erasing all of his, all of his uh, buffs, so. We were on the right track, I feel, though, with the answers. Otherwise, he probably would have wiped us before. Hey, Clive hit him this time, so that's a plus. Now this will nullify some stuff, or not will nullify, but reduce. Oh, whoops, no, no, going too fast. Poor Lombardia. The poor thing just doesn't get a chance. I mean, which is fine, so. Jet, no! Love it. Yeah, see, he honestly, like, starts to overheat himself, I think, which is actually really cool. Uh, we're just gonna keep doing that. No criticals, I'm disappointed. That's huge. yet Now he's going red. Beat the hell out of him. Just seeing those damage numbers is incredible. I just got to kind of go slow.
We can't give a dragon anything like honor, and power's kind of out of reach, out of our reach too. Then mortals, tell me what thou shall give me. Do we go with option one or option two? Something to quench your desire. Let's go! Fight me to quench my thirst, thou will. If that's what you really want, what said thou? That's not what you're after. No fight could ever satisfy a dragon's desire. Then what sayest thou? What quenches a dragon's thirst? Peaceful sleep. Powerful dragons get nothing out of fighting and burning things on the battlefield. If they did, then you'd be pretty satisfied with all the fighting you've done so far. I think you just want a world without war, without fighting, so you can get some deep sleep. Isn't that right? You want to stop being you, a dragon that lives just for destruction and chaos. And I, I want to stop the forces that seek to devastate our world and make it peaceful again. To gain my strength, mortals had to be stronger than me. What contradiction? But woe to be mortals, or but woe be to mortals. They came and met their fate at my hands. But thou dost seem different. Thou wouldst seek that which I seek and desire to quench my thirst. Mortal, tell me thy name. Virginia, Virginia Maxwell. Virginia, I thank thee for doing what no other hast done. For that I bestow upon thee this honor. Thou shalt not be known as a dragon slayer, but as a dragoon. And my wings shall soar through the skies together with thee, Virginia. Do we have a, do we have a quote unquote airship? Like, like Pog? Can I finally, oh. My God! When Lombardia morphs into an Aeromech or morphs into Aeromech mode, you can take her anywhere in the sky over Filgaia. Press the directional button or left analog stick downwards to descend. Likewise, press it upwards to climb. Press the directional button or the left analog stick left to right to rotate in place. Press blah 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 blah. Fire, fire missiles. Hey. <laughs> Uh-huh. I can explore the world map and not have to worry. Alright, so first first order of business. Where are these big ass rocks over here? The soundtrack though. Aha! Uh -huh. I just gotta kinda look everywhere now. Make sure that there are no barriers. I am curious though, like what happens if I do this? Like, what is here? Nothing. That's so cool. Alright, well, let's do the right thing. Let's... Let's land here. Let's rest, get our ECN back. And then we can go do some exploring. Now, now I'm actually excited to explore because, wait, hang on. Is this the lady that tells me what day it is? It's always a day ahead that is so strange to me. It's probably just the, the PS4 or the PS2 clock. Uh, This should be where I should be able to sleep here. The thing that I'm pretty sure this is Virginia's house. Okay, good.
Hope everybody in chat is having a good time. Oh, oh, okay. So first order of business now that we have Lombardia is let's go to the garden to reap our rewards. We haven't been there in a very long time. We don't we don't need the silly sand craft anymore. We can also land here. If if there's anything on this like little area um it's either where we're supposed to go next uh or perhaps millennium puzzle this looks like a millennium puzzle dissection facility This is where Sis was taken. Do not fret, Master Alfred. I promise to do all I can to rescue Milady. I must do this to honor your predecessor as well, as I am in debt to them. I ask for your patience. Thanks, Todd. I'm counting on you. I can count on you too, right, Shady? Eh, you need me, don't you? Then yeah, I'll help out. Count us in too. All right, let's go. I'm going right out the door. That's where I'm going. All right. Well, we know where we're going next, which is a huge, huge plus. And I hope it's on the map. Okay, good. It is. I just want to go check out some of the... How have I not been up here? Really? It's not even blocked off. Millennium puzzle. All right, we'll give it a shot. Might as well. We know where we're going. We'll, we'll have some fun. A two star. I said in the previous stream whenever we were doing one of these that sometimes these two stars are harder than you think. All right, let's just start here. Um... So I can probably push. Yeah, we got to restart. That's what I'm saying. Like sometimes these get, or the, the two star ones can be harder than like the four star one I've done. Uh, what happens if I do this? So this one's going to be more trial error. God. For as many controls or buttons as there are on a controller, they, they had the map dash to confirm.
Oh wait, there's no orange. All right, so do I? I'm gonna. I'm, all right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this orange one. Or wait. Yeah, let's take the red. Let's push it here. Then. How about I put this one here? Because what this will then do... Okay. And then I'm out of yellow. Yeah, so that's definitely not the correct play. <clears throat> All right, so let's not touch those. Let's. So the answer's over on this side. So let's try this. Let's just debunk this theory. Okay. Okay. If I can just get down to one or wait. Oh, this still won't matter then, because even if I were to do this, I'm going to be left with an orange. Um, okay. Well, we already made a little bit more progress on that. So now, what if I did this? And then did this. Okay, well this actually doesn't work because that orange one all right <clears throat> that orange block up there is the issue so let me think how I get that one down so if I hit yellow here
Okay, well, the puzzle's solved now. <laughs> Let me set this up right. Only took a few tries. And a growth egg. So the the lower the difficulty, the Obviously, the uh, less the reward is essentially, which I mean is fine. I can't see. Get back on our Durgan. Yeah, see, if we're going to find anything, it, it's Millennium Puzzles. How come all the easy ones are, like, in the areas that you can't even access? Let's see if I can get this without. Let's see if I can get this one first try. Um, I'll just start here. Think, gotta think. doing it First try, let's go.
That one wasn't too bad for a one star. How many have we done so far, actually? Nine. There's gonna be one here, too. Wow, I'm... I'm genuinely surprised. Why do you do that? I'm trying to blow this rock up. You're literally going through the rock. All right, that's clearly something I can't blow up then. Alright, surprised there's nothing on top of here. Like, now you gotta think, because... I'm gonna save... Whatever... We're, whatever, like, possible enemies are on top of here... Uh... Wow, nothing. All right, black buzzards weak to light. Actually, the experience there isn't actually isn't too bad. Ah, oh, you can't land on that. Dang it. No, <laughs> just want to go down. You gotta like take a look on every island, right? A signpost, nice. What does it say? Towering over the western heights is Balak Rise, a secluded village surrounded by sand and rock. Western Heights, okay. What's well, east? Got scared for a second. I was like, wait, what? Eel Volk. 
I just analyze. Uh, they're faster than me. Alright, that's fine. Like, if they attack Gallows, that's fine. Clive should finish it off. Yeah, no. just cheated out no stop Probably not the most efficient way to get something done, but I'm gonna do that every time. Hit circle and then circle again. Maybe there's really nothing here. Probably gonna get annoyed uh, over the ascending and descending sound, but I don't want to get in an enemy encounter right now, honestly. You would think they would have put something like up here. Or even like on this this little platform like just have something wait we're right by basker village so looks up granny look what i got i got a new toy We'll rest, save, continue on our little 
escapade. Still have yet to go to the garden. That was our original plan now that we got our little ship, but I'm actually having a lot of fun finally being able to explore like all this on oh, you know. Honestly, I probably shouldn't even worry about this too much. Let's go. There, this sign was here. There is a spot that can't be reached. I'm gonna call a horse on top of this. village that we're looking for yep block rise so this isn't the destination where we're supposed to go in the main story but this is just a village that's up here so let's see what people say well this road you travel blah 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 I wonder how like you guys get up here Migrant seal. Huh. I was I was expecting a little bit more to be there, but oh, whoa, what? Be careful when you're checking out the telescope up top. I remember a grown-up getting cussed out after he got caught spying on something he shoulda. Oh. Well, see, now that yeah, you peak Jet's curiosity. Ever hear of Gunner's Heaven? It's an arena where drifters fight for honor and prizes. No, huh? never heard of it. I hear it's beyond the dunes where the sun sets. They say the guy who wins the highest honor gets him granted by the Lord of the Arena himself. Okay, we knew about that one. Welcome to War Drums.
Uh huh. All right, Clive, I see you. Oh, I can't upgrade her either. Another mini carrot. So now we'll go check out the telescope, see what all the fuss is about. Take a gander. What? Why can't I look in it? Lame. I guess there's really nothing here then. Nothing else here. Where? Picking something up. Ah, it's the bird. I don't have a tool. It's a tool for Virginia. I don't know where to get it. Just out of curiosity, let's just spend the night and see if anything happens here. Personally, I can't imagine. All right, yeah, I thought so. All right, well, I mean, we found this village, so maybe if it plays a significant part somewhere, we at least know where it's at, so. All right, I think, I think we've had enough fun. Uh, Scouring around. We'll just do some like last second snooping. Den of Miasma. All right, well, clearly that's a dungeon that I don't feel like going in right now. We have it on the map if we need it, or at least I hope so. Yeah, okay, we do. All right, so if we need it, it's right there.
All right, let's let's uh, continue on the main story, shall we? There's a duplicator room. We have like 1,400 duplicator keys. I want to look at something real quick. Tags. Those are so annoying. Out of every item that they could have possibly gave us in this game, they give us name tags. They don't do anything. We strong man. I didn't mean to skip that. So, I wonder how we get over there. Weakness fire and lightning, let's go. You know, this whole time I just realized that I did not go where I wanted to the garden, but it's fine. We really don't need to go. It's just, it's just more items for us. Yeah, we, we really have no choice but to fight. They keep taking our ECN down the whole way. All right, so we'll deal with this. You're kind of scary. It might as well. Uh, 
Nice. Nice try. Wow, really nice try. Everybody's got fire effect. They're fire ward. Jesus. Leave this to me. The predecessor, Milady's father, was a great man. He was a strong defender of justice. He raised Milady and Master Alfred as a single parent. A very gallant man, indeed. He took a, he took a good-for-nothing man like me under his wing, and I was honored to work under him. I was unable to repay my debt of gratitude to Lord Schrodinger while he was alive, so I vowed to take it upon Milady and Master Alfred. I shall get my lady back and repay my debt. Uh, uh, okay, we'll, we'll do our best as well. Just like, all right. You can't just do this to me. Can't just put a treasure chest in my face. So what happens? get a weakness from both of you. Probably. Weakness to win. That ain't too, too bad, actually, because Gallows can deal with that then. We're just gonna basic. Might as well check what's up here. Lucky card. That lever looks suspicious. Shady, if you would. Forgot he can fly. This dates back many generations, but I was summoned by a Schrodinger and locked up in a puny little box. Day after day, I would help him out with various experiments, but in the end, they sealed me inside a box for what seemed like forever. That's when Madame rescued me. At first, I thought about getting even with the Schrodinger people, but 
She invited me to join in on her fun, and boy was it ever. I never felt so excited and free in my life. I'm having so much fun. I've got to make up for lost time and have as much fun as I can. I think it's time we start using these. For good measure, of course. That was an accident. Alright, so I think I have an idea. That's, that's exactly how I thought it was going to go. Ocean Berry. Nice. Boss fight. Hey, this is the latest issue of Disaster Girl in the Wasteland. I was halfway through part three while I was on the train. That's my sister's book. So Sis really was here, but it's odd that Sis would just leave her book on the floor like this. Maybe she's trying to tell us something by leaving it here. Hmm, that door looks suspicious too. My sister has trouble expressing her feelings with words, so people tend to misunderstand her. The truth is, she's the nicest, most caring, and hardworking person I know. Yes, I know. I, too, haven't been able to express my true feelings with words. Even though we don't talk, I know someone cares about me very much. I understand how difficult it is to reach out to people with words. Thank you. My sister's a little you-know-what, but please take kindly to her. I'm sure she really wants to befriend you. You... you really think so? Okay, stand back. Oh, he's blown it sky high! All right! That's it? Yep, that was perfect. Working with explosives is in an art form. There's really no reason to blow everything up. I just blew off the part that was sealed. Well, let's get moving. Ooh, there's a duplicator door. Mini boss, let's go. journey of self-discovery don't forget me oh my god yeah let's just wait <laughs> kill him fast oh 
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, stop! He's my only healer! So he's weak to everything, okay. Well, everything other that's not physical. So he only takes physical. Okay, okay, we figured it out. What a weird fight. Like, seriously. <laughs> So, does he deal damage equal to how much health he has? I'm hoping he doesn't get a turn. Okay. This might actually work. Five well, has to go fast, like be faster than that thing. And he's not. Damn it. actually is this actually might be rough um there's gotta be like a faster way here
because then he'll just bring him back to life. Like, I'm pretty sure that's about how it's gonna work. So now my next theory is is he gonna will heal we yeah will he deal damage equal to the amount of health that he has left or is it total health so that is the next uh we're about to we're gonna test that theory right now We figured it out. So physical reload, physical. Oh, we just get free damage here. That was a little difficult at first, but it was just because I had to figure out the thing. Oh, okay, holy root, nice. I wonder what this does. I think a picture is being transmitted. Wait, let me see if I can bring it up. Whoa! How nice to see you again, mortals. Siegfried. Dun dun. I remember, you remember my name. I am honored. Hmm. Is Maya safe? Of course she is. However, that all may change depending on your action. Let us commence the negotiation. You get me the teardrop in exchange for the damsel. Do you want to play dirty, huh? But the thing is, we don't know where the teardrop is. The negotiation stops here. That is not a problem. She has revealed everything. That's a lie. My sister wouldn't give in to you. As a matter of fact, she did. Voluntarily, too. The light tear shatters to pieces as it builds power and becomes a memory. The memory lies in the heart, forever, in the ruins of memory. That's the information we dug up. But how did... What did you do to my sister? I had a chance to study up on her abilities. She uses a book as a memory storage unit and converts and installs the internal data for her own use. Her spiritual strength exceeds those of demons, generating an extreme illusion through this internal data. A form of auto-suggestion, or a powerful auto-hypnosis, gives her the ability to transform herself. These are the details of Maya Schrodinger's supernatural powers. Intriguing, is it not? Ugh. However, no matter what form she assumes, her innate personality always exists. That is wit. That is what I have uncovered. Sis! Your honest self.
I look forward to receiving the teardrop. Was that really Maya? Well, we have to find the teardrop first before we can make the exchange. About that information, yeah, it mentions ruins of memory right in your face. Think it's a trap? This information isn't a rumor that has recently started floating around. I really think this lead is genuine and reliable. Okay, we've been in there before, but we might have missed something. Let's head to the ruins of memory and find the teardrop. I'm sorry, but would it be all right if you go on ahead? I need to prepare something before the exchange takes place, so we can't go there just now. All right, but hurry. We'll meet you inside the ruins of memory. Alright, so remind me again. Ruins of memory. I tried. I hope I'm going the right way. missed in here like I mean, we don't need to worry about special link or, you know, any enemy encounters, so.
I like like I assume there's something that I'm missing Oh, you know what that's uh That, that looks like um, Asgard. I, I like I seriously don't know what what we, what we could be missing in here this out wait do we not do we not move that wait a minute but Okay, but what's the point of these then? Oh, they're put out. Uh, I wonder, I wonder if that's a, that was a, okay. That probably doesn't matter anymore. Like, what's the point of coming here? I'm confused. Like, we've been in here, so... This book. Gotta be in that mask room, right? Like you would think.
there like something behind these? Okay, no, this didn't do anything. Get it. What could we be, what could we be missing? Beast kitty. All right. Where? That doesn't do anything. You think there'd be like some sort of hidden passage or something? Find it. I don't know what to do here. Sparkle, the teardrop shines ever so high. Many have tried. Uh, I see it. Okay.
that was that was simple <laughs> i've i've done many of those in my day oh this is kind of cool Listen, I know it wants us to look at the big red painting, but a large painting entitled Flame hangs on the wall. We're gonna catch it on fire. Small device with a thin slit is attached to the wall. up kitty what you want to come say hi come say hi come on come on nope they probably want food oh what do we have come on you want up i'll be good That's what I meant to try, was that, not the ID card. That's my mistake. There it is. The teardrop. I've heard that in ancient times, the desert seas used to be filled with blue sparkling water. Just like the surrounding area of Yggdrasil? Yes, but probably of a much, much larger scale. An ocean spreading far beyond the horizon, huh? Wow, I can't imagine that. It must have been beautiful, kind of like the gentle blue of the teardrop, almost as if caressing you. But the fact of the matter is, they're trying to destroy Filgaia with this thing. That's right, but I'm not gonna let that happen. No way. Oh wait, is maybe this her final tool? No, damn. Of course, we try to leave and... Oh, look, it's a trio. Now, hand over the teardrop. You must bring Maya first. You'll be all right. She'll regain consciousness soon. Now you must fulfill your end of the bargain. Hand over the teardrop. Stay sharp. Who knows what they're up to? Got it, thanks. Huh? The Maxwell girl, the Maxwell girl is more foolish than I thought. You have willingly handed over the future of this planet. Sorry it took us so long, but it looks like we're here just in time. You wily little fox. Look who's talking. Boss fighter. 
Uh, alright, well, he's doing his dumb thing. Uh, so let's just do this. Let's do lucky card. Let's do... Um, oh, wait, she decelerates, doesn't she? Nope, okay, good. So, lucky card. Uh... We're gonna defend. We're gonna defend. We're gonna decelerate because I forget she's doing some weird poison thing. A weird bubbles. I, I don't know what that is. Play him first, see what happens. Kind of just want to see what happens if we analyze. Like, if he's actually weak to anything, he could be. He's not. So I'm not going to use I thought he was getting faster already. That's fine. We don't need to worry about our party ever dying. What is this? Uh, that's a problem. That's what confusion. Oh, he's dead. Nice. All right, so something's gonna happen. Either Clive's gonna hit uh, Lee Halt or it's gonna hit Melody. Perfect. Nice, okay, so she's gonna probably poison with every counter hit. Um, which is fine. I think almost everybody has poison ward, honestly. Okay, yeah, they're just not weak to anything. So good. 
So whenever the color, if you ever see the color kind of go a little wonky, I have a Hyperkin component to HDMI, and ever since I bought it, it's just been shit. Oh wait, she. We'll just heal Jet. So everybody but Jet has Poison Ward. Which is actually kind of funny. Live crit. Five crit. Damn it. Oh, she's dead. I think he reflects damage dealt. Yeah. The so Clive might actually die. <laughs> yep, Clive's dead. Bye, Clive. Every time, every time. Clive's gonna have to sit this the rest of this fight out because he's got to heal. He's got to most likely heal Jet until Virginia racks up enough force points to just uh, heal everybody again. So like this is a pretty simple fight right here. It's just I gotta there's just timing involved really Damn it. Nice. 
fight's over. What was that? Asgard? That's impossible. We kicked that thing's behind to the outer limits of space. Space time with the help of Dandarium. Face the music. It's here, ain't it? Standing right in front of us. I shall act as a shield for my master and carry out his command through hell and high water. Master, I have returned. Returned? Then that means to fulfill my master's command and exchange fire with you again. By the way, Master, did something happen to you? I shall explain later. There's much I want to ask you, too. Let us be on our way, then. Wreak some havoc. As you wish. Activating barrier, full power. Things just never go right for us. That was, that was weird. Dad? If they're using a barrier, I'll counter it with mine. Barrier? What is dad saying? Don't move just yet. They probably think we're buried alive under the rubble. We have to take full advantage of this situation. Dad. I was so happy to see you again, dad. I really was. I had completely given up on you until I saw you. I was so shocked and bewildered. That's why I said those awful, those hurtful and hateful things to you. I wanted to apologize right there and then, but I couldn't conjure up the courage to put it into words. I'm sorry, Dad. You're not the only one who can't express their feelings in words. I, too, have had something I wanted to say locked away inside my heart. I... You don't have to tell me now. I know you'll tell me someday. I'll be waiting, waiting to hear what you have to say. But don't leave me again, Dad, please. We were all, we were all this close to getting buried alive. Dad must have saved us. I saw my father in my dream. Hey, what happened to the teardrop? Unfortunately, it's in the enemy's hands. But don't worry, I mixed the special I mixed in special metallic flakes in that bomb that I used to startle them. Metallic flakes? How's that gonna help us? These special flakes that I developed transmit a signal that pinpoints the exact location of their whereabouts. They're tiny silver particles that attach firmly to the target's skin or clothes. It's even designed to withstand one or two washes and laundry. You're smarter than you look. And this is the radar that picks up the signal. It took me a while to get all this ready. That's why we were late. See? This flashing dot here indicates their current location and... Oh no! What's wrong? I've lost sight of the target and its current location. Point blah blah blah. The signal seems to have gotten jammed west of Laxland. All is not lost. We still have the last coordinates. I better write these down. X fourteen seventy Y seventeen five seventy. Uh, west of 
Galaxis land. We can very well assume something is there at the jamming point. Yeah, even like, like even their hideout. No sense crying over spilt milk. Let's split up and head out there. If that really is their hideout, then mine is probably... All right, so where's Laxus land? Now, what are those coordinates again? 14. Say it's got a hundred percent be up here. Cradle of the Metal God. All right, um, I'm gonna stop and save here. Um, we made it pretty far. I think we actually made some pretty good progress today for the two and a half hours that we got to play. So, um, there's probably gonna be some monster hunter tomorrow and Friday for sure. Um, maybe, maybe some wild arms on Friday, if not Friday, Saturday and Sunday morning. Um, but thanks to everybody who watched. If you definitely like what uh, you saw, definitely drop a follow. It helps me out. Um, this video will probably be on YouTube either tomorrow or the day after. I'm trying to upload. I'm, I've been uploading some, or trying to get caught up on uploading some stuff. Um, whether it's our Monster Hunter World gameplay or the, uh, Wild Arms 3, which I believe I'm caught up on Wild Arms 3. So the only thing I need to do is upload two Monster Hunter videos. Um... To, the, to YouTube, so but yeah, once again, thanks everybody who uh, stuck around and hung out. Until next time, have a good one.